We start with a new public safety alert. The Drug Enforcement Administration is warning parents about the online sale of fentanyl. The alert explains how traffickers are using social media to target children with the deadly drug. This comes as we learn even more deadly overdoses on Oahu. Our investigative reporter Allison Blair has new information in tonight's top story. Officials confirm fentanyl is suspected in at least four deaths on Oahu in the span of eight days, including two here in Kalihi. For law enforcement, I would say this is a red alert. The head of Hawaii's high intensity drug trafficking area says fentanyl is a danger everyone should pay attention to. Certainly a time where we really have to uh, take action. Between October 4th and October 11th, Law enforcement was called to investigate four suspected overdose deaths, one in Kaimuki, one in Hawaii Kai, and two in Kalihi Valley. Sources confirm a hazmat crew found fentanyl at each of the scenes. The most recent deaths happened Tuesday at a home off Kalihi Street. That's where officers found the bodies of a man and a woman both in their 60s. This is the first time we're seeing so many deaths. Absolutely. The DEA recently issued a new public safety alert directed at parents. The first page is a fact sheet that explains what fentanyl is and why it's so deadly. The other has information on the online sale of the drug. The DEA says traffickers are using social media to advertise and sell fentanyl. The agency also provides a list of emojis that could indicate drug transactions so parents can decipher messages. Meanwhile, local, state and federal law enforcement say they're working to choke off the supply. We're doing intelligence, we're gathering information and trying to use this information to target specific areas and items. Honolulu police also sent us this statement saying HPD investigators are working with federal law enforcement to detect and intercept imported fentanyl and to arrest and prosecute traffickers. <laughs> Parents are now being advised to get Narcan and learn how to use it. The nasal spray can reverse a fentanyl overdose. We posted the DEA's advisory on our website. You can find it in our top stories. In Kalihi, Allison Blair, Hawaii News Now.